So today I want to talk about gratitude, uh, or more specifically, the practice of keeping a gratitude journal. Uh, it's something I picked up a couple of years ago, and uh, it really has transformed how my mind works day to day. And it's not something that you have to do every day for the rest of your life, but if you do it long enough, you'll notice that just the uh, the practice of gratitude or being grateful for what you have just kind of bleeds into how you perceive everything. And it's really transformative because a lot, unfortunately our human brain is kind of geared towards focusing on what we don't have. You know, like I want a bigger house or I want a million dollars or something. And that's just kind of how it's what makes us want to achieve more and keep going and work. So it's not necessarily a bad thing, but when all we focus on are things that we don't have and what we want and not enough time is spent on thinking about what we do have and what we should be grateful for, we kind of get in this never ending cycle of uh, feeling bad and you know not really feeling fulfilled. So the practice of keeping a gratitude journal is super easy. Just every day, first thing when you wake up, write down five things you're grateful for. And it doesn't have to be anything too intensive. It can be something like, I'm grateful that candles exist or that I have 10 toes or whatever. Like you can be whatever's on your mind that day. And it could be super simple, but it's surprising how powerful that can be. And when you make it a habit of doing it every day, you start to notice that, you know, these little stresses and things that happen throughout the day don't really affect you as bad. So like one example is, um, you know, if you're sitting in traffic, we all hate traffic, and you're annoyed because you're late for a meeting or something, you can actually switch that, that annoyance, that feeling of uh, aggravation, which is obviously a negative emotion. You don't want to hang around in that feeling for too long. Instead of focusing on being late for a meeting and sitting in traffic, just think, wow, I'm so grateful that I have a car. I'm so grateful to live in a city with freeways where I can go back and forth uh, to my destination. And it kind of seems weird at first, it's kind of like hokey when you think about it, but I promise if you actually practice that, it will help to shift your mindset from this wanting or unhappiness to a feeling of uh, gratefulness and being more happy for what you do have, and it's very powerful. So the practice that I want everybody right now to do for the next 30 days is first thing in the morning, as soon as you wake up, write down five things that you're grateful for every day for 30 days and pay attention to how you operate throughout the day. If you feel a little bit happier, more satisfied, and you're you know, maybe not annoyed as much, uh, it really does work. It's helped me a lot. And like I said, it's not something you have to do for the rest of your life, but if you practice it every day uh, for a month, I think that the effects will be more long-term and lasting. So give it a shot. Take care, y'all.